Okay, uh, good day. Uh, today I will show you, I will try to show you how to uh, install the Kinect uh, dashboard update so you can use your Kinect. Um, susubukan kong ituro kung paano uh, install ang uh, Kinect dashboard update para malaro ang mga Kinect games or para mag uh, gumana ang Kinect camera. So right now, nandito tayo sa Dash RT dashboard. Uh, maaring uh, you may have Aurora dashboard on your screen. Depends po. Uh, anyway, the, the process should be similar. Maaring same lang po ang uh, proseso. Uh, first, we need to take our controller. Press natin yung home button. Lalabas yung screen na yan. And then, makikita nyo yung Y. Xbox Home. So, as soon as press ko yung Y, as soon as we press the Y button, uh, it will ask me to end my session. Uh, I will I will press up and yes. Uh, before I press yes, sorry, I, as soon as I press A on yes to say yes, to, to select yes, I will immediately press this button. Uh, that's uh, RB. I press ko yung RB. Okay, if I do this correctly, I should be, sorry for the blurry camera, I should be greeted with the Xbox home menu, okay, yeah. from here, I will go to settings, settings, press A, system, then find console settings and then on the bottom of this page I will check it's the system info it says dashboard 2.017489 okay I will take note of this version number okay and then uh, we will go to our computer get our flash drive yes you need the flash drive kailangan po natin a flash drive Preferably 4 gig, 8 gig, or 16 gig. Uh, the flash drive must be FAT32 formatted. Must be authentic uh, flash drive. Ni po pwede yung mga counterfeit na chip na flash drives, or you will uh, risk breaking your Xbox. Anyway, so our dashboard is uh, 2.0.17489. Let's take note of this and then let's go to our computer. Okay. Okay, we are back on our computer. Uh, I searched Google, ginugel ko yung ating uh, dashboard name. It's uh, 17489 Xbox 360 dashboard. I was shown this result, so open ko siya. Uh, DGX. Yung ibang version, kung ibang version na lumabas sa inyo, open nyo lang. Uh, open the site. Dapat sa bottom niya, mayroong makikita kayong download link. So download nyo lang siya. Medyo mabagal lang aking internet. Then, it should be around 100, 100 MB to around 200 MB. Okay? Next, we will uh, take our downloaded file. And, we will go to our USB flash drive. So, sa akin, sa akin, ang lumabas ay, so, na-download ko na siya, no? Ito. Uh, we downloaded it. And then, uh, What's inside is this file. Okay, system update. Uh, it's dollar sign capital S system uh, dollar sign capital S system update. Okay, so I will extract this to my uh, flash drive. Okay, yeah. So naka extract actually naka extract na ako sa aking, uh, I've, I've already done that. So, I will rename this uh, from from dollar sign uh, capital S system update 17489 I will change it to I will remove that uh, change that to uh, dollar dollar sign 
dollar dollar sign ISTEM update so that that's dollar dollar sign y s t e m u p d a t e okay so after i do that i will now eject my uh, flash drive okay and we will uh, take our flash drive and go back to our xbox we will now go back to our xbox we will uh, insert our uh, ilagay natin yung ating usb sa xbox here is our flash drive uh, before ako mag return sa aking uh, before ko ilagay yung uh, uh, usb i will go to the um, i will press back okay i will uh, go to the screen uh, when I'm in this screen, okay, okay, when I'm in this screen, um, I will uh, prepare my SD card. Lalagay ko na yung aking SD card, okay? Uh, pwedeng sa front, it could be at the front or at the back. Okay, as soon as you press, uh, insert this uh, SD card, uh, memory card, or USB rather, uh, you will be asked for a security update. It should say security update and not a system update. I will show you a photo of that uh, of that message. Uh, Nina kasi sa lalabas dito since updated na tong aking uh, Xbox. Uh, I will get a photo and show it to you. Okay, uh, this is the photo or the message that you will see. Uh, this one. Update required to proceed. Security and program updates are required. System updates will be added to ensure security proper. Yeah. So press yes. It should say. Uh, it should continue normally and update. Uh, after that, your Xbox should uh, restart. Uh, should you face any errors like red lights, just remove your SD card, and then unplug your power cord and then turn on your xbox again okay i have to check if uh, the connect update is already present um, repeat the steps ulitin nyo lang yung steps how we got here from the dash rt dashboard or aurora dashboard by pressing the home button and yung holding the rb button then the connect sensor should be on the bottom right of your screen already it means the Kinect is already working and you can play your game your Kinect games okay uh, if you have other questions or you need uh, further assistance you may contact us uh, message you lang po kami uh, you can also check other guides on YouTube uh, actually mas complete yung guides nila mas uh, credible and mas ano mas uh, so maganda yung mga guides nila this guide is hopefully nakatulong how to get the Kinect games working on your uh, Xbox okay thank you